I guess I should have made a video before I spread everything out, but y'all know the story. I get busy and I forget. But I'm just going to show you what I'm doing here now. Um, I spent the whole day moving dirt with the articulating truck. I'll get you some videos of that. Um, loading and dumping everything on this spot here. Um, but, of course, when I'm done, I have these, you know, big uneven piles. So now what I'm doing, and, and the piles were, you know, pretty tall. You really don't want to raise your grade too fast or you won't get good compaction. So what I'm doing now is just going back and forth and I'm using the bucket. You can see I'm just dragging the teeth just along. I'm using the bucket kind of like a bulldozer, um, but using it to smooth this stuff out and, and level it all out real good and break it down and uh, also take the level of it down just a little bit more. I want it to only be about a foot thick. And you can see here, we're gonna get right to the end. Push out that little bit of excess. And I'm gonna swing the body just a hair and back down. And you know, this doesn't have to be perfect by any means just yet. What I'm actually doing right now is just, I'm smoothing it off and then I've got a full load on the truck. So it's good and heavy. And then I'm gonna run the truck back and forth on here use it like a compactor just the sheer weight of the truck will compact this so for right now I'm just kind of going back and forth and this is kind of compacting it some you know with the teeth dragging through it and me running back and forth on it it is compacting it but really what I'm working on here is just kind of doing some rough general grading kind of dispersing spreading it all around so I get kind of a, a good level but I can tell you I like the way it's going so far um, as far as running that articulating truck I got more dirt moved today in one day, I feel like, than I did in two or three days with a, with a dozer and a little dump, which maybe a little bit different conditions, but anyway, I'm just kind of rambling now to probably bore you guys. So I just wanted to kind of show you how I was doing this. I don't know if this is a recommended way to do it. You know, I'm no by no means a professional dirt work, earth mover kind of guy, but uh, Seems to be working for me, so I'm gonna keep doing this probably another 30 minutes, get it broke down real nice, and then I'll get the truck on it. Well, you'll have to excuse the sun, uh, but right down here in front is stuff I piled up, and then all out there, which is where the garage and guest house is gonna go. It's piled up at least a foot, uh, which is pretty impressive. I wish I'd gotten a before picture for you guys, uh, but I just was going back and forth on it with the excavator, uh, grading it out. To thin it down a little bit and uh, now I'm gonna get the truck on it and just go back and forth and back and forth and pack it with the truck so I'm not really gonna not gonna get a video of just going back and forth with the truck I don't know how interesting that really is but somebody probably want to see it but I'm not gonna do it today anyway um, kind of run out of daylight so I'm gonna get the truck on there and pack it as much as I can and then shut her down all right well that's it for today uh, I ran back and forth on top of it probably about 30 minutes and um, you can see where it still wants to kind of clump up a little bit between the tires each time. Um, or not between the tires, but the other side of the tires. So it's squishing a little bit. I, I think I probably laid it in there a little too thick, which I kind of suspected. Um, so what I'll do here, I'll be back out here in a couple days. Um, I'll go through with the bucket again, like I was doing, and back drag it, and I'll peel off that top, uh, top layer, top foot or so, um, to where it's all down smooth, and you... And peel it like that and you know just, just let it fill in over there where it needs to go anyway and uh, keep doing like that and then run back and forth on top of the truck again and when I get to the point that it's not squishy like this um, then it'll be time to start stacking on top of it again but uh, by far the most progress and earth moving that we've made in a day in a long time and I say we but I guess I should just say me good day very good day and uh, the truck you know she's a little poochy but um, it ran, it ran all day, never got stuck, did what I needed to do, so I can't ask for a whole lot more.